Well, we know uh, it's been a rather long summer and uh, apparently grape growers are saying that could be a later harvest for wine grapes. Growers have about a month left to strip the vines. Proffer's Ellis Agamonian is at Shug Winery in Sonoma with a look at how it will affect this year's collections. Driving past Sonoma County fields, you might have noticed that it took just a little bit longer for these leaves to change color, and soon you'll be able to taste the difference. A lot of rainfall this spring caused a later start to the grape growing season, and cooler weather in the summer has pushed up harvest season by about three to four weeks. It's a much needed boost after recent years of fires and drought. Winemaker Johannes Scheid says more time on the vines means more ripe grapes. So the 2023 collection will be bigger, more intense, and complex. That extended time makes for more fruit and more flavor development later in the wine, so I'm actually very happy with a little bit later harvest this year. It's all hands on deck as the late harvest season requires careful attention so that the grapes are picked at the perfect moment. Inundated with fruit, industry leaders explain wineries are at the mercy of receiving more grapes than usual and multiple varieties at once. So the need for more and efficient labor goes up. And grapes, you know, you don't want to wait too long, uh, especially when they get a little bit closer to the end of harvest and possible rain approaching. But here we mostly do um, Pinot Noir, Chardonnay and a little bit of Cabernet Sauvignon. So we're not going to face these problems and we're going to be really excited. Logistics aside, it's all about the flavor. The later harvest season means sugar, acid and tannin levels are expected to be balanced, which should make for a tastier sip. So here's a toast to 2023, which is expected to be an excellent year for the wine industry. Reporting in Sonoma, I'm Ella Sigamonian.